I feel like there's also something else that's bothering you and I don't know what that is. We don't spend a lot of Malika and Chloe time. We spend a lot of Malika, Chloe, and the guy time. I do love the boys. I do have a great relationship with them, but I don't, it's not our relationship. And I don't- It's not, but I think sometimes the people that you spend the majority of your time with become priority because they're right in front of you. And I just don't want to feel like I, I don't want to come secondary. If I want to talk to you, I don't, maybe don't want to talk to you in front of all the guys. Mm -hmm. Or, you know what I'm saying? And it, it, it is a, a bit of a strain. I don't want to blame you because you moved. That's so childish. But I think it's hard. Like, you and I, we went from seeing each other how many days a week mm -hmm. to, like, seeing each other every other month. I want to be around you and spend time with you, but, but like... Why don't you just say that? Don't cry. You don't have to cry. I always cry. Well, I love you. Regardless if I agree with everything she's saying, her feelings are her feelings, and I'm never going to invalidate them. So if Malika feels like I'm not good at giving her that individual one-on-one -on -one time, I have to be more aware of that, and I need to make a better effort. I do try to communicate with you when I'm there. I will try harder. Well, just call me and talk to me and tell me you stubbed your toe. Tell me you tripped down the stairs because you're clumsy. Just talk to me. You know what? Life does get in the way. And I don't think that's a bad thing. I think we all have to be secure with our role in each other's lives and just be okay with that.